now what we need to learn is so we have learned how to communicate from parent to child using the props now what we need to learn is the how we can communicate from child to parent so let's say that for example h2 is there div is there single post is there i will try to wrap it here in div call mod 8 to call mod 8 so in this one i will try to so here let's copy these all the things and paste it here and in this call mod 8 so i will be having another one call mod 4 what is happening to my system this one keyboard gone nothing working so if i will add it call mod 4 so i am having this another view so in this one i will show something like latest post so latest post let's see the output how it will show it yeah here i am able to show the latest post so here we are able to see all the post data and here latest post so let's try to use the same post data only okay so here i am having one ul so this one is one class so these are all bootstrap classes list group and i'm having one li one li class is equal to list type and group type and item i will be using and this one i will be looping out so v hyphen per is equal to post in post so same post data right post in post here i can use post dot title okay we need to use the key Key is equal to post dot title we'll try to maintain this one okay so everything is correct right yeah so let's see the output so here i'm able to see the latest post so it's the same title i'm trying to use it here we are having some latest post now when i try to click on this one title 2 so here when i try to click on the change title so what will happen so here we are trying to change the title this dot post data dot title post title change we are trying to change the title so let's see that whether we can able to change it here also or not okay here also or not let's try to change it so if you try to click on this one so here it is also changing okay if you try to observe that means when you are trying to able to change it here somehow we are able to understand that in the child component so when we are trying to change the title in the parent component also this title is getting changed so this one is added in the parent component right this post editor so that means this post data are able to update when we are trying to change it in the child component so that means this two, these two are able to communicate it but actually those three are these two are not communicating so <clears throat> internally what is happening is so all the post data latest post and all those things are sharing the same object so that means the same memory location it is trying to change it uh, share it so the same memory location when it is trying to share so this one it is trying to change the data which is present in the same memory location now this latest post is also using the object which is present in the same memory location so that is the reason this version is also getting changed so we have discussed in the javascript uh, reference data types how the reference data types actually works so in that one object uh, so it will share the same memory location whoever changes the data automatically everywhere it will change it so that is the concept i am trying to tell you here okay here actually the parent and the child are not communicating to each other but the data which is present they are present in the same memory location now it is changing means the child component is changing on the same memory location automatically these all are also getting reflected but here let's say that for example so here i am trying to change the copy so i am copying it okay instead of using the same thing i am copying it here so i am creating a new memory location for this post data now if you see here i am refreshing this page i am clicking here this one has changed but here this one not changed so i am clicking here this also changed but in the latest post is not changing so now here i am trying to change this data post data but here wherever this post data is getting reflected those are not changing why because this one is a separate component and this one is a separate component so how can i communicate to each other so how can i communicate to each other so how we can communicate to each other is so here when you change the post data dot title so here you need to tell that this dot dollar emit so you are emitting a custom event okay you are emitting a custom event so that you need to tell that 
post changed or anything so any name so whatever the name you want you can keep it so post changed so here you send the post data so this dot post data okay so here i am having some trigger uh, trigger function name okay trigger name em emitter name custom event name also you can say it actually these are custom events so custom event name i am telling and the data i am trying to pass it so this one what we need to do is so in the post so we are having a single post here right so here i need to use at the rate so whatever the name we have used it here the post changed right so this name we need to use it and here i need to write it so here you can write on post change or something like this so this is the thing we need to use it so we can have any name so this is a function name so this method name we can write it here on post name so you will get the event value or otherwise single post so we are trying to send that value right single post you will get it so in order to have a differentiation let's try to add the id also so id is equal to one so id is equal to two so for the post also we are having some data so id is equal to three okay i am having this data so we are having some ids now here we got this single post single post means nothing but the changed post so here this post data we are trying to send it here i will, I will be able to receive it now what i can do first i want to find the index so where this actually in the post it is present this one so here i can change i can check something like index is equal to this dot post dot find index so you can do whatever the logic you want find index so i will be getting the post so post dot id is equal to is equal to single post dot id so i am able to get the index so now what i can do this dot post of index is equal to single post i can change it single post or otherwise we know that only the title is changing right title is equal to single post dot title that's it so now we are able to get it so now if i try to click on this one so let's see we are able to get it or not if i click here see automatically is changing see if i click here automatically is changing now i am able to communicate it so what is happening here let's try it. i will try to explain you so here in the single post so whenever the user clicks on this link okay change title this method will be invoked so when this method is invoked we are trying to update this one in our local variable this is a post data is our this component local data the local property data property so we have updated this title so that means in this component only it will be changed so parent component cannot able to know that one post data has been updated so now we are trying to emit the data so emit the data means we are trying to send it to the parent so here we are emitting and we are using this event name custom event name whatever the name you can use it and here we are sending the complete post data updated post data to there so here and we are using this custom event name so at the rate post changed so custom event change so whenever we are having this emit custom event changes so we need to capture it like this custom event name and we are calling this method whenever this one is emitted so whenever this post change is emitted immediately this method will be called so immediately this method will be called means so here the post change will be called and it will get you the single post data so the single post data is nothing but this dot post data only now we got the single post and i am trying to find out what is that component what is the child components we are having three child components right who has invoked the emitter event we are trying to find the index and after finding the index i am trying to update the title so post data is directly automatically got updated every again it will be re-rendered single post is all latest post will be re-rendered again so this is how we can communicate from the parent from the child to the parent using the custom events so here this is the events you will be having so here this is the events you are having right so at the rate click these are all the default events so these are all <coughs> default events we will be having so we can also emit custom events okay so these are all what we are trying to use it is a custom event some event some event like this we are using so these are called as a custom events this is how we will be using the uh, this is how we will be communicating from child to the parent so now whenever you are using these emitters okay whenever you are using these emitters so it is a good practice to use at the top so that we can able to understand what are the uh, custom events we are having emits and here i can use something like so we are using one custom event so this is the custom event 
so that anybody who was seeing this component they can able to understand that okay these are the custom events we are having so we can we can add it here so there is not a problem so if you don't mention it ourselves not okay but in the view 3 it has been introduced so we need to not not necessary we can, if you mention this one it is better so these are other custom events we are having in this one emits these are things we can mention it and also if you want to mention it like this post hyphen change so if you mention it like this and here also you need to mention it like post hyphen changed only okay so you should not mention it as post capital change so it will not work so here it will not work so here you need to use it like this only the name should be matched to each other so this is the custom event so this is how the custom events uh, by using the custom events this is how we will be making communication from the child to the parent